Greetings from Knoxville, Tennessee. My name is Christine Waxstein, and I'm truly honored to be this year's recipient of the Innovative Learning Through ETDs Award presented by the Network Digital Library of Theses and Dissertations. I am forlorn that I was unable to attend the conference in New Delhi, India to accept this award in person, but I am grateful to be given this opportunity to thank you via this recording. I owe a special debt of gratitude to the School of Graduate Studies at East Tennessee State University, and in particular to Emily Redd, who thought to nominate me for this award. I also would like to thank my wonderful thesis committee headed by Karen Brewster, who served as chair, Kara Harker, who additionally served as the director for the dance concert, and Cher Cornette. I could not have completed digital illustration, the costume designers process for East Tennessee State University's Spring Dance Concert 2012 to the same level without their guidance and expertise. The use of technology played a vital role in not only the creation of the digital design renderings for the project, but also in the presentation of my thesis. I believe using embedded videos into the actual paper was an innovative means to present the finalized costumes while incorporating footage taken during the concert. This allowed for a real-time representation of the completed designs. Particularly with dance, the way the costume moves is a crucial element that was considered throughout the design process, and I was pleased to find a way to effectively present that. Additionally, I utilized software in an innovative way. I incorporated the use of Adobe Photoshop, which is popular in the photography world, to create my design renderings. This is not a program widely known to costume designers. Using any sort of computer programming to create renderings seemed to be foreign at the time of my research. I attended several conferences where I was able to meet costume design professionals from around the country, many of whom still use the traditional method of hand sketching their renderings. The focus of my study was on finding new ways to utilize this technology to more effectively translate conceptualized ideas while potentially saving important resources like time and money. In my thesis, I offer novice photoshoppers step-by-step -step instructions on how to create these renderings. I hope that this presentation may inspire a few of you in the audience to take a look and try it out for yourself. Again, I thank you for your time and appreciation for my receipt of this honor. I hope you all have a great rest of the conference and I look forward to reading all about it. Thank you.